guys, here we are, and I'm here with a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to inventory edit in Terraria. So, basically, what you want to do is, first of all, you're going to need a couple of things. Basically, what you're going to need is you're going to need, first of all, you're going to need, oh god, I'm repeating myself. Okay, you're going to need either the APK or the IPA of Terraria. IPA and APK, IPA is a default format for iOS. For downloading and installing applications, APK is a default um, format for Android. So what you're going to need to do is either download either one, depending on your um, your uh, phone, which is Android iOS, and you're going to need to install the latest version of Terraria that is not Wolf point two point four. So yeah, what you need to do. Is when you're gonna download that, and I'm gonna use AppK for this because, well, that's how I get my free apps. If, in this case, only in this case. So, um, what you want to do is you want to download Terraria using the APK or IPA of the latest version of not 1.2.4, and I'm gonna press install because that's what I need to do in order to install it. And since I'm using AppK, you just want to wait for it to install. Just wait for it to install, and then once it's done, just, you know, just wait. It's all be done soon. Okay. Up there, see up on my top screen, it says install Terraria. That means that it worked. So, yeah. Uh, as you can see below uh, my dock, uh, Terraria does have look different. That's because it's the newest version of Terraria that has not 1.2.4 or the latest. What you want to do is open up Terraria. I'll say it'll come up with ever play SDK. Just press OK. It doesn't matter. No matter what it says right there, it will work. This tutorial will help you. So you want to open up Terraria, you want to wait for the, the extraction files, and you want to press OK. doesn't matter. No matter what you do, your files will be OK. Just press Create a New Character. I'll name it A, just for this tutorial. And it doesn't matter. Put, name it whatever you want. You want to name a word whatever you want. And what you want to do is you want to press X, it doesn't matter. And you want to get two things. You want to get a piece of dirt and or a piece of of uh, wood. So the reason why I'm using dirt and wood is because I know that those uh, those Terraria item ID their item IDs by heart. Uh, dirt is two and wood is nine. So I know those by heart because well they'll have to hard to rem to remember. So what you want to do is you want to download either the game gem for iOS, SB Game Hacker for Android. Uh, yeah, and you, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to game gem. And you want to select Terraria. And then you want to search two, or in game, or game killer, or game uh, SB game hacker. You just want to search it up two. For SB game hacker, it'll open the uh, it's loading thing will open it into area the app, so it's look it may look a different. So I just go look look for two. You want to open up Terraria, press the game game. You want to switch the wood and dirt block like this. So basically, the dirt and wood right here like this. And you want to move it like this. So wood is in front of dirt, or before if dirt was in front of wood. So you want to open up your hacking tool and you want to switch up 9. And then see how it says 90? That's not a good thing. So you want to do is you want to look back to your area and just want to switch them again one last time. And then you want to search for it. Search for 2 again. And once you reach 26 for iOS, if you're on iOS, that means it'll work. So you want to go to here and you want to select all and you want to modify them and for this tutorial, I'm going to use 1944, and you want to modify it. For what you, if you want, if you want a specific item like these, just go to trade.thegamefeeder.com. Link in the description. Underscore slash item underscore IDs. I'm and the trade one point two before items start at part seven. So I just want to make sure that's true. Starting on at um right here. So yeah, so you want to scroll down a little bit, and then anything beyond part 7 is part of 1.3.4. So I already modified mine to 1944, 
That means that it's modified. You want to go back to the Terraria, resume game. And as you can see, it's different. That's because I changed it to an elk shirt. That means it works. So what you want to do is you want to exit out Terraria. You want to close it from your multitasking. And then what you want to do is you want to open up the, um, what's it called? You want to open up updates and you want to, as you can see, create an update. That is because it is in lower version and now is an update. And the reason why you need to have the bot in the first place is because, well, uh, in order to update things, for I, well, at least for iOS it does, in order to update things, you need to have a bot. Since I have a bot, I can just press update. And then it'll update automatically. Instead of saying, this has been bought by a another Apple ID user, you cannot update because you are, well, it that. It'll ask you to log in with their Apple ID, which I do not know AppCake's Apple ID, so I'd rather just have to update through my Apple ID since I've already bought it. So, once it's done, the um, next want to do is you want to wait for it to, for it to load. Um, I will probably uh, go. I will probably do either do a uh, time lapse of the of it waiting, or I will do just cut until it's done. So yeah, I will be back. Okay, guys, I'm back, and as you can see, Terraria is almost done. So once it's done you'll see it's updated. So you wanna open up Terraria, the newest version since you just updated it, and you'll see extracting files. What you wanna do is just wanna wait until it's done extracting files like you did before. Once you wait, just wait until it's done the extracting, and then almost done already. Pretty fast, pretty cool. Pretty nice, nice, nice. Okay, so it's just done. You wanna, you wanna wait for it to go. And you want to go to your character you used. You want to go to the world you used. And as you can see, moment of truth. If I go to here, I have an elf shirt. And I can use it as an elf shirt. Everything is fine. Everything is good. And it works. Okay. Whatever. Um, yeah. So, one little bad thing about this is that, well, for some reason, Terraria is really, really mean. And it only lets you uh, hack in at least three items or three anything at a time. So anything more than three, there is a higher chance of the files, not the file, but like the um, player, the items do not show up. And when you try to use them or put them in like, or they do like, don't, they don't work as if it was the real item. Like the real item of the elf shirt, why can you put it on? If it was corrupted item, then it wouldn't let me put it on. If I tried to put it in the chest, it would never go in the chest. If I tried using it, like placing it somewhere, it would disappear. That means it doesn't work. So if you did correctly like I did, since I only did one item, it's all good. Yeah. So yeah. Um. Let's go. I just hacked in an item. Hooray. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys didn't, sure smack that. Prayer Monka videos. And yeah. Um, see you next time. Bye. That was the weirdest voice ever. Bye.